Hi, this is Sherry Veronica. Peter Koss is the principal of St. Leonard's Boys School. It's a secondary school in Barbados. He is someone that was sent there by Mia Motley. They took him from the garrison and they put him at St. Leonard's Boys School. Now, in his position, he has a secretary and he has a deputy. There's a deputy principal so it can't be that he's overworked okay it cannot be because he he has the means and the people where he can delegate he can delegate certain certain work to certain people now there was an incident at this school where a Johnny Trotman was hurt okay he went his mom took him to the hospital or to the doctor to the doctor and when she reported back to the principal, Peter Cox, he has within his purview uh, a budget where he can reimburse her with the money she put out because of something that happened from a schoolboy. The schoolboy's name is Jaden Murray. And he has within his purview, he has within their budget the wherewithal to refund parents when they take their kids to the doctor he tells her to come back she comes back he's surprised by it he tells her to come back again she comes back again he's surprised by it he takes her name her number everything and he tells her to come back she comes back and he is surprised by it she wants her hundred and thirty dollars he's surprised that she's coming back and he asks her for her name and her number and it's like Groundhog Day. Every time he sees her, she goes through the same thing. Every time he sees her, it's like the same thing. He, he doesn't even have a file. It's like she has to go through the same hoops, jump through the same hoops every time she sees him. And he's dismissive, difficult. He, he's not dealing. He's not really dealing with matters at the school. And... It's, it's bothersome for some parents. It's bothersome for her because, you know, these they love to give kids 10 days home when something happens, but they're not really dealing with the something that has happened and why it has happened. They're not dealing with the real issues, the matters. I'm going to try to get Latoya on with me on a show because she can probably explain this so much better than I can but parents are frustrated by this particular principal okay he is not working out Mia this guy is not working out he was put there at, you know, at the last minute it seems and he, he's there to what to sweep things under the rug not to deal with issues why is he there and what is he doing it's not working out it's not working out okay and in the meanwhile this particular parent she wants her hundred and thirty dollars back and it's something that should be done can be done and he's still he's acting as though it's his money he's acting as though it's coming out of his pocket okay and every time he sees her it's groundhog day again what's your name what's your number why are you here you know when he's telling her to come back so yeah I'm going to try to get her on to talk more about this, okay? Yeah, that's what we're going to do. I'm going to try to convince her to go on radio and talk about this. So Latoya, listen out for me to call you to tell the people more on how you're frustrated by this particular principle and how he's not doing his job. He's not, that's, that's the bottom line. He does nothing. He's doing nothing, okay? He's just doing nothing. And the thing about it is, like I said earlier, he has the he has staff where he can delegate duties he can tell them what to do and ask them to to you know to fix up these these particular matters and deal with these particular matters he doesn't have to take everything on his on his plate and pretend that he's the boss and he's he, and he's so important and whatever else he's he's pretending to be okay so peter cox i'm going to try to get this parent on radio and we're going to talk about you a little bit more okay this is sherry veronica